Hello, my lovely Pisces. How are you guys? Listen, um, usually on my channel, I usually do, um, I usually have been doing, uh, see, I have a new mic, so I'm in love with my microphone. Um, but uh, I usually do past, present, future, challenge, all of that. Talk about, listen, I'm not here to talk about anybody but you, Pisces. No cross watchers are, are in this, nothing. Hold on, let me see, let me get this here. All right, so I'm going to be doing your today news. This will be your daily reading for today. What to look out for, what to expect, what, you know, just how you're feeling, what's going on with you today, Pisces. All right. Mm -hmm. Oh, Pisces. It's been a long one, hasn't it? <laughs> it's been a long one. I don't know. Has anybody else been feeling like tired, lazy, or very, very energetic lately? Because I've been feeling a little energetic. All right. Okay. Pisces, I'm a bit rising. Tell me, what is Pisces needing to know for today? What does Pisces need to know for today, August 6, 2020? Right. All right. So, for today, Pisces, the general message is the Ace of Swords. Hold on, let me. The Ace of Swords. All right. So, you could either have. You could either have. Let's set that right there. Um. All right. You could either, all right, so there's the sun, which means there's fire, could be fire in your chart, or a whole lot of passion and drive or sex, um, fantasies, dreams, you know, um, so that could be representing Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries. With the Eight of Cups, Three of Cups, Four of Cups, that is water and all your emotions. This is definitely dealing with lovely emotions with Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. And with the Ace of Swords, there could be a little bit of this is all in your head, but with new thoughts, new ideas, new dreams, new passions, new visions. Um, which could be a lot of air in your charts with the Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. So, let's get started, Pisces. <laughs> Alright, so, here with the sun in your charts for today, I am seeing... Oh, I feel like you're the center of attention, either at work or within some type of social entourage. So you are lit up, Pisces. All eyes are on you. You got to try to keep your feet on the ground, though, because <laughs> you, you can enjoy the attention, but remain modest and kind. Okay, Pisces? Now, as another up hit news for Pisces today, I see with the Eight of Cups here, wow, Pisces, you are 
definitely walking away from something and I feel like with this eight of cups you may be for some of you Pisces um, you're going to experience something new that's what you're walking towards and you don't want to you know just let everybody know your business you're very quiet mysterious mystique you need to break out of your shell what's keeping you tied up and constrained pisces you can't be like this forever you know move towards what you want and what you want to do the eight of cups is is sometimes negative but don't expect something bad to happen every single day there will be some sun here. Okay. Now, moving on to your next daily news for today. We have the Three of Cups. So, with the Three of Cups, I feel like Pisces, male or female, you have just accomplished something great. It may be like a personal project, a time-consuming, professional assignment. You know, it's finally over. This harvest is showing up. This is showing up and showing out. That's probably why you got all these hand claps coming around you and stuff like that. That's probably um, something you definitely been waiting on some type of promotion something that you know you've been working hard on could be a a marriage here you finally got married you finally got on your feet you finally got your business off the ground um from pushing forward with that hard work that hard effort and now you can reap the fruits of your labor with celebrating with friends with family whether it be your family or your, your special someone's family next we have with the four of cups you are closed to solutions that's going to actually help you resolve problems in your life but this can manifest in your denying love or whether that be love to someone else or love to yourself you're stubbornly ignoring a better way of doing things. And that's probably because you got a little pride in here. And you got a little, you know, anxiousness in here. You got a little bit of, you know, I'm the shit in here. And that's all good because you are the shit. So, you know. But, like I said earlier, you know, don't be too, you know, prideful or cocky, you know. Um right now you know what's up everybody knows what's up with you <laughs> okay so with this ace of wands here i'm gonna tell you right now you you pisces are definitely interpreted like you're very you're using a lot of you are using your gift you're, and you know where you're headed. Something unexpected is about to change. And it's going to affect you personally. But a lot of you guys are using your gift. A lot of you guys are very intuitive. Um, I'm feeling there's a certain damn Pisces in here that is so gifted. It's ridiculous. But don't be the one causing the violence or stress. You need to calm down, okay? Acting rashly isn't always a bad thing, but make sure it's who is controlling you or your actions. Who's controlling them? Make sure it's you and not your emotions controlling you. Because some things are unexpected that you don't know about. And it may be you, you know, unexpectedly doing some things. Just because you're following a vision that you may not need to follow. That's what I have for you today, Pisces, in your, you know, personal daily news reading today. Thank you for watching my channel. Um, 
It's been a good one. I wish you nothing but love, light, and happiness within yourselves and within your homes. So stay free and stay blessed, Pisces. And thank you yet again for joining my channel. Bye.